What's up? Happy people. It's good with you. Tap in, tap in, tap in with me. Tomorrow is a, a bullshit ass holiday. Really holy days, but they call it a holiday because they trick knowledge. They like to flip our words. Who going to church? Who, who's still out there going to church? Who's still mind control, mind fuck? Who not under that divine protection? Who? Who out, who out there still calling themselves black? Who? Can't do that no more. Can't go by these old ways and old teachings. They're not even old. We can't go by these new age teachings. You going by the Bible, that's a new age teaching. Because you yourself don't even understand self. So you can't understand the Bible if you don't understand yourself. You know, God and the word black. Man, that them two words play, y'all. If I get up here, I'd be like, fuck God. <laughs> y'all scary. Y'all don't even know what God means. Y'all ain't even did the etymology behind it. Y'all mind control. You program to think outside of yourself and not within yourself. So you know what you get? Nothing for yourself. Everything you get is for outside of yourself. The car that you pay your house, your bills, the job you go to, everything is for someone else. Granted, it's not wrong with helping people, but you can't help nobody if you depleted. It makes no sense. That old way of thinking is dead. You know, just cause you wanna respect your grandmama or your grandmommy or whoever didn't taught you that bullshit. Hey. That's a real dangerous thing right there. I understand loyalty, but being loyal to something that's not true, that ain't cool, man. Not correcting the person because you scared of what they might think, that ain't cool. If somebody can't take correction, then you don't need to be around them. Because one who takes correction is one who stays on point. I always got to stay on point. But look, we're going to talk about this PPP. Now, everybody's guaranteed this PPP. So we understand. The moment you was born, they made your mom fill out the application for a birth certificate. And she went down and got you a social security number. And you was doing business. Pulling hella equity off of that shit. And you wasn't even at the legal age to contract. Fraud, but you know, fraud is something a, a debtor can do. So, you know, you want to learn words of equity, forgiveness, you know, trust. You hear them words? You know, prayer and forgiveness. Them two words you want to speak in court. Y'all know about that equity. Like, we speaking on equity now. Like, motherfuckers in the Forex market and they in the stock market trading our equity. Like, is y'all crazy? Do y'all not know what's going on? Like, you making seven dollars an hour. You really supposed to be making like four thousand dollars an hour working at McDonald's. You supposed to be, listen, y'all the ones out here accepting Federal Reserve notes. You can negotiate your own contracts, but you can't be a minor. 
I'm trying to tell y'all, anything in this life is what you say it go. You are a manifestation of what you think every day. So if you want some bum shit, that's what you think. You can't bum shit every day. You know, if you think higher of yourself, then that's what you're going to reflect. And it shows in these times who the hell you are. You can't fake it. All that fraudulent trying to fake people's self, that shit show like this. Because the moment you fake somebody out, it's going to be somebody to come around and help them. You know, it's always two sides. So you might fake somebody out and then somebody's going to come and help them. And that help is going to show where they got faked out at. And you're going to be the motherfucker looking bad. Was it done in the dark? Always come to light. So you out here fry, frying people. You had you got a whole government that's built off fraud. So I understand why people minds are conditioned to fry people because and they they getting frauded out. It's like people helping a jealous God. You know, you believe in God, I believe that you jealous of me. You feel me? Because I don't, I ain't, I ain't going to accept what you, what you kicking, but I ain't going to disrespect it, but at the same time, that ain't me, but you're going to get jealous that I'm on to something else, you know, we made all that to teach people, teaching people, and then you failed to them people vibration, so you picked up that same book that we made to teach them, but one in the same, it, it helps you remember something, but most of y'all, and went off track because you can't discern that book because that book is so bad 66 books may sign it revised so many times so you get in there you start reading it so literal you can't even go back and do the etymology on it or even you know go back and translate the scripture into its original it's crazy because when you do that it's changed then they tell you in the back of the Bible, this book should not be changed, but it was changed many times. It's been revised. So, really, what's in the book, they take truth and mix it with falsehood. That's all they're doing. It's like the nation of Islam. They're like a spinoff. You know what I'm saying? All these people out here doing good with their organizations. I don't believe them. I don't trust them. You know, Farrakhan just be speaking to people's emotions, riling people up on that shit. And you get the fuck out there and you go do that black people shit and go fight people. Like, yeah, Farrakhan a whole fraud. Like, come on now. People gonna take this truth and use it for their better good and make they self look good they ain't gonna give it to nobody else like these is false prophets false teachers whatever you want to call them in these times because like they say Farrakhan went and got five million from Gaddafi and was able to come back here it's all a show you know it's all a show right? and then the more your mind feed to it that's the reality that you create and that go back to what I'm saying like, you are a manifestation of what you think every day. So if you want some bum shit, you just a bum. Like, that's what you're thinking every day. You're penny pinching, you're thinking less. You know what I'm saying? I, I cut those type of people off. As soon as you start penny pinching, you want to put a little here, a little. Nah, because I see right there, you don't think. You see on a bigger scale, you just see small. So that's what you want to return. What you put in is what you, you know what I'm saying? You get out the situation and a lot of y'all just don't get nothing out of the situation because you don't put nothing there just you had to put something there in order for it to manifest y'all want to put nothing there and want something to manifest and it just boggled my mind like you want to do the bare minimum and then expect to receive the top notch of everything but do the bare minimum like, if I sat y'all down to do this work that I do, you couldn't do it. You know why? Because you're too, bu you're too busy doing something else. 
or something else would distract your mind to where you will fall behind, you know? And I don't like messing with people who have doubt, you know? The energy is real, you feel it. And these times you're gonna feel everything. You know, we on a whole new plane, a whole new, like we going up. We not in that old time no more. So a lot of things that y'all are trying to do and manifest with, they not, it's not gonna work. It's not going to work. What's up, man? What's up, Ra? Just on here ranting, talking, talking to the people, checking back in. What you been up to? Hope everything all right on your side. Yeah. I mean, they got people out here waiting on stimulus checks. Just doing all type of stuff with your account on your estate. People like they trying to protect their social, but they don't know how many people are on their social. You ain't protecting your social. Oh, what's up, Tiffany? I mean, yeah, yes, yeah. I'm here talking shit. You gotta talk shit. You know you gotta talk shit. Oh, nah, I know you busy, you doing your thing, you know. I already know you doing your thing. When you got time, you got time. But yeah, y'all need to get y'all shit together. Y'all worry about this social security number that your mama created for you. That you don't own and even say on the back of your social security card. You need to call me back, though. Call me back. For real, for real. Mm. But yeah. Get y'all shit together, cause if you don't bullshit, I can't rock with you. Not in this time. The energy real. I can feel everybody energy. If you a bullshitter, you gonna feel that shit. You gonna have to get the fuck. Get the fuck. But look, I might get back to work though. Came to check in on this page. Cause I'll be on this page. I gotta clean this page up. I'ma get back at y'all. 